Wave and tidal energy. Wave and tidal energy are both renewable energy sources. There are two types of wave and tidal energy, fixed and floating. Fixed is when the generator is fixed to the land, and floating is when the generator is loose and floating on the ocean. Wave energy. A fixed method of, method of harnessing wave energy is the limpet. This method works by the use of waves floating into a column filled with oxygen. As the waves float in and out, in and out of the column, the water pushes the air in and out of a turbine. As the air moves, it drives the turbine. The turbine is connected to the generator, which produces electricity. As the generator is connected to the land, this is a fixed method. The limpet is located on the Isle of Islay, on the west coast of Scotland. The limpet produces electricity for 350 homes in the surrounding area. A floating method of harnessing wave energy is the pelamis. The pelamis is four large cylindrical sections, each 140 metres long, which float upon the sea and are connected, to, connected together by a motor. As the sections move up and down, due to the waves move it, moving, oil is pumped through, through the sections and through the motor that connects the sections together. As the motor spins, electricity is produced. The electricity is fed down a single cord to a junction of seabed, which sends the electricity back to land. An example of this is the, Pel the Pelamis located on the Orkney Islands near Scotland. The Pelamis provides 3 megawatts of renewable energy, which is enough to power 3,000 homes. The advantages of wave energy. Once, the, once they are conducted, they are very, very cheap to run. They do not generate any atmospheric pollution, only during construction. They have the potential to generate a fair amount of electricity. The disadvantages of wave energy. The, waves harness, the wave harnessing machines need to be constructed on a fairly wavy place. The, only the limpet can be fairly noisy. The pelamis can be damaged by ships. Tidal energy. There are two main types of tidal energy. The first is a tidal barrage. These are dams built across estuaries. How it works. As the tide flows in and out, water passes through the gates in the barrage. The movement drives turbines. Turbines turn a generator, which produces electricity. Some turbines are only generated by outgoing tides, but some by incoming as well. How does a marine turbine harness tidal energy? It works like an underwater wind turbine. Fast currents caused by moving tides turn turbines, which turn generators to produce electricity. Advantages of tidal energy. There are low running costs and no fuels required. There are no waste products, for example, carbon dioxide, which is a reliable electricity source. Disadvantages of tidal energy. Few suitable sites. There are few suitable sites to generate tidal energy. It's expensive compared to other renewable energy sources. Tidal energy technology is still in the development process. Building large structures has an environmental effect.